Give it a minute to load up here. Good evening, everybody. Welcome. Something new for me. I am Shoemaker, Technical 13. Known by many in the DDO community. Um, and I decided it was time for me to break out and try something new and different. So here I am in Lotro. I've got another player with me that's been playing for a little while. I have no idea how to pronounce that name, but he is in Discord chat with me. You should be able to hear him. I will share a link for the Discord chat. Discord voice chat's right there if you want to join us in voice. Public server for DDO, or for Lotro stream here. Thinking that we were going to do some festival stuff today. Just waiting for Sal to make his way over here. Hello. Sorry, I'm in trouble for some reason. It's not... It's still, registering my still 4,100 meters away. Welcome, Blue Queen. She is another well-known entity on DDO stream. Cool. I'm going to warn you guys now, I cannot see uh, chat, chat. Uh, one day I'm going to fix that so I can. But for now, I'll just rely on you. <laughs> um, just for a little information on me, just you can either go by sale or top. Uh, I've played for about, I've got like a six, seven years on lifetime membership. And I enjoy Lotro and DDO. It's, they're both a lot of fun. Both great communities. And that's about it. And I need to get to you, so <laughs> that helps. Tad bit. I was trying to find the bloody milestone in this festival, but I can't find it for some reason. Wait, why am I running? I've got a Freeland milestone skill. May as well use it. Can you hear me alright? Should I try to turn myself down a little bit? I can. Okay. Just double check. I don't want people kind of, like, not hearing half the conversation. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Where are you? Oh, you're on the other side of the mountain range. Great. <laughs> Mountains are good. Yeah. Except when they, except unless you're in Skyrim. In which case, they're the bane of your existence. <laughs> are they? Well... For me, they are, because you have to run all the way around it just to get up the mountain, the big main mountain in Skyrim, and it, it's annoying sometimes. But whatever, we're here to play Slo Lotro, not Skyrim. This way you're not a chit chat, because it's going to be a while. I could get writing skill, but I, I find that you get to take in the scenery more when you're not writing, because writing, you're just like, Oh gosh, I hope I don't fall. You'll, it, it, you'll especially get that feeling when you um get into a uh, war riding. War riding is like real horseback instead of this normal riding skill that you use. Because it's like with the normal riding skill, you can basically turn on a dime, and that's not realistic in my book. I believe Shu can reaffirm us on that information, can't you? What's that? That real horseback riding is not like a turn on the dime thing. Depends on the horse. No, I may be wrong then. 
my hair. <laughs> I've been on a few horses that you'd swear turn on a dime. Will you give me a moment of your time, friend? So yeah, how do you enjoy the look of Breland while you're, since you're here? Alright, so I picked up that one. What else is out there over in here to pick up? Fireworks for the festival. So, show map things. Turn these ones off. Fireworks vendor. Greetings, friend. Or fireworks. These days are shorter. Elf, Hobbit, man. What can I do for you? And apparently several in is their EP now. I found that on the Lotro forums the other day, where he introduced himself. Interesting. Uh, uh, be careful when leaving that side of your uh, map, because these enemies are like level 11, not 11, uh, like level 15. So, um, if I'm not careful, I can easily die. Oh, come on now. I didn't die. You sure you didn't just teleport? Sure. Hmm. I just... The wrong direction, then. I just ran through. I ain't afraid of you. No, well, you're almost here. Yeah, that, that's a dead end path anyway. I gotta go around it a little bit. There might be a way up, but I'm not gonna risk it. So, I want to say you have great barrels unlocked already. I, I don't really know. But once we get to that point, we can worry about it. For now, we got festival stuff to do. Yay! <laughs> uh. This guy actually looks pretty good in this game. You probably rarely see it in DDO. Bob Ninigan's Field 2. How's the, de how's the weather down there? Great. Kind of muggy with a small chance of death, but, you know, graveyard. Oh, come on now. It's just a graveyard. <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately, a lot of ventures are going to be coming there for a lot. <laughs> so, Titan, when are you going to join me and play some Lotro? I've already extended an offer to the Blue Queen, but she's got too much stuff going on with Lanny and the Prince. Are those other people that she plays with, or 
Is that like a turn you got? <laughs> She's the blue queen. Her young son is the prince, and his stuffed animal is Lanny. Oh. He likes to throw Lanny. Lanny goes, Wee! Splat. Pretty much. <laughs> I remember having a little pet frog when I was little. You see what I mean? We are just a little coward at this stage. But believe me, they fall off later. Where are my heels? Uh, I don't know. I've never played mini very much. Apparently, I took them off my my bar. Let me find my character panel and put them back. Skills. Raise my spirit. I wanted to put them on the other buff bar. That's that's what it was. Raise my spirit. Soliloquy of my spirit. Those are the only two I think I have right now. Yeah, I've actually got to heal myself. It's called Harton. Harton. It's actually pretty nice at this level. Heals 43 morale initially, and then 30 to 43 every one second for eight seconds. So I'm going to, just... I'm going to put them on my offensive bar too for now. Yeah, it might be good. Just because I do a lot of soloing currently, mm -hmm. and switching bars from DPS to healer is going to be a pain. I'm sure I could keybind it, but. Right. Indeed, Elda, Eldeth, El, Eldeleth. Ah. Keep wanting to put that A in front of the D. What D? Eldeleth. Her name. I keep wanting to saying Eldeleth or something. I don't know. Ah. I keep wanting to switch, transpose the D and the A in her name and just say Ella when it's actually Elda. So I'm supposed to be finding fireworks in the next hour. I don't know where the fireworks are to collect them from. Here's the milestone that I used. Cool. Start reading the quest, they tend to tell you where to go. There, I shared it. Firework vendors can be found in Dulamond, Thorin's Halls, the Party Tree, and the Bree Festival Grounds. It's probably you should head to the Bree Festival Grounds first. That's probably yeah. the closest. And that's due south, right? Three ones? Uh, don't ask me. I don't know anything about this. Quest. <laughs> uh. What's the name of the person we're supposed to talk to? Probably a shopkeeper of some kind. Robert Greenverge. Rawr. <laughs> oh, <Master s bear. laughs> Robert Greenverge, right here. Yeah. Ah, it must be well, a green be back there. Greetings, friend. Yeah, right here. Uh, this guy's got some man fireworks. I bet you buy that. Uh, has what? Man? Oh, man fireworks. Yes. So we just run around and buy those. Cool. All right. So I have the man fireworks. So now we have to go get dwarf and elf and hobbit. So, where are the other places that we need to go again? Dillamon, Thorin's Halls, and the Party Tree. I know where the Party Tree is, and 
Michael Fassett just died there. Can't. I don't have a mount. No, oh. I mean, like, kind of stable mounts, but. Oh. If you have a I... find the best place to do something of that sort. Uh, I believe West Bree has a, like, right of sight gate to our south on the one of my rings to the wall. <laughs> So we're heading. So we're heading south to Bree. Yeah. Oh, I think insert is the walk button. If you guys want to walk. Why would I do that? Uh, role play. I don't know. And we take the leap of faith. Ow. Weird ISP issues. Aw oh man, I broke my leg. Nah, you didn't, you're good. Did you actually break your leg? I don't know. It shows a broke. It shows a, a broken broken knee. What it shows. Yep. <laughs> Don't actually take damage though. You just get no, gimped up. But, uh, if you're like in the wild with lots of enemies around, or if you're in um, the, 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 the uh, you know, PvP zone, it, it'll get you killed. Because while you're broken leg, you can't parry, block, or dodge at all. Mm. Yeah, so sometimes it's better to just run around. Oh, of course, his family pops in and out the game. Every single time. That's cool, right? Oh, right, these enemies only threaten. They don't actually attack. Well, they do attack and stay within range for too long, but... Yeah. I ain't afraid. I'm Shu. Shu's never afraid. You must love to play chicken. Alright. Uh, if we go in and then take a right when we see the main part of Bree, we'll be able to reach a stable mess. But this is the edge of Solomon. Kind of makes sense. It's, it may as well be the capital of this region. I mean, it's not a capital, but yeah. Okay. Capital here, capital there, capital flying through the air. That would be an awesome sight. <laughs> you know, except for the evident falling down. All right, the stable master for now should be blue. That's how you recognize him. You can also see his name. Alright, let's see. Go on skate and the life should be automatically unlocked for you. Uh, so you want to go to Thorin's Gate? We may as well because that's where that's how we're gonna reach uh, the elves and the dwarves. Which I know it sounds weird, but look, there's a dwarf behind us. If you're really that curious, just look at the wiki. <laughs> I've been doing a lot of editing on the wiki, actually. I've been doing, um, other stuffs, like, back-end stuff. What do you stuff that we don't normally see? Yeah, stuff you won't really see too much. Hmm. Alright, so where's our firework vendor? That part I do not know. Alright, if we look at the map... What kind of icon would we be looking for? If I had to guess... A blue trader banner? That might actually be helpful. 
or a green vendor trader? Well, the actual fireworks are going to come from the green one, but we don't know where the expo is. Expo, we got to figure out. All right, so it looks like west or west west. Looks like over this way. It's in here. Crafting shop? Yep. Probably not in there. Oh, it says Thorin's Hall, so let's go up to Thorin's Hall. I bet it's in there. Making footprints in the snow. I do see a little ring up there, suggesting that might be our target on the mini-map, since I have... Firework, fireworks for the festival is our selected item. Hey, it went from like 50 minutes to 43 riding here. Did it really? So apparently your riding time, even though it's not real time, does take time off of your timers for that kind of stuff. Oh, it probably would have taken just as long to run. The notary. Oh, good lord. Provisioner. Wait a minute. It says found in Dolion. Thorns Halls. Firework vendors in Thorns Halls. Featured instant reward vendor. No, oh, no, I'm sorry. Duleon is actually a different place. That's the open one. Ah, uh, my bad. You're, 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 you're probably right. Let's see here. Looking for firework vendor. Ball keeper, burglar trainer. Ball keeper, escrow broker. Traveler. Yeah. There's like a lore from a lore aspect, I doubt it would actually be inside Thorns Hall. Do you wanna check the Winter Hall and I'll check around outside? Sure. Yeah, because we only have like 40 something minutes left. Good. Could put up a poll. Or ask 
Ask, ask. Let's see here. Armor Smith. Tree's not that hard. That's how Sable masters a horse that takes the break of the party tree. Let's see here, where's the quest log? There. <laughs> that was a bad idea. Very bad idea. I wonder what the provisioner has. Wait, what's this guy moving? Master of Apprentices.
Greetings. There. Hmm. Did you find the fireworks vendor yet? No. I accidentally teleported to the party tree. Uh, now I got to run all the way back. I'm not seeing it in here at all. All right, let's do this. can be purchased from Huni inside Thorin's Hall Inn. So where's Huni? Find that real easy. Let's see here. Located in the basement under the King of Hall of Kings. Okay. So. I gotta go up this way. And go over this way. Aha. I think I found it. Hidden little area. Sneaky, sneaky. Get thirty minutes to get to the last two. Uni fireworks vendor, I found him. So if I buy the fireworks from him, does that apply for both of us, or? Of course not, because they're flying on the fire. Okay. So now we need to do elf and fire in Hobbit. So now I gotta get back out to a stable master. Well, we could probably start with um, What's closer? Durian or the other one? Alright, Durian is to your southeast. It is on the way to the Shire. It's pretty long way, but you'll probably get there faster by running, because I don't think there's a, you have access to those to travel yet. Um, head, head along the road, basically. If you open your map, you can see it on the map. Well, right now I'm still inside the hall, so. Actually, if you hold your 
once you look at the map, it'll show you a little green where it is. So I don't know why we had such a hard time finding it. Because he's actually hidden in a little hard to find area of the hall. Oh, yeah. That's probably the only hard one. Party tree's easy. There's a instant travel to horse near the stable master to party tree. Okay. Okay, I'm wrong. Go to the stable master that we were just at once we leave the halls. Go to the party tree. And then, uh. Uh. I'll drag it from there. Make it about there. Um, stable master. There's a horse nearby that will save two party tree. There he is. Yep. And then. So party tree. party tree, that's where we're going. Vendor there with the uh, trying to think of the word, uh, vendor that has the uh, fireworks. Oh no, 28 minutes. Eh, not even time. Oh, there's a lot of travel between these. Party tree, festival horse to the party tree. Okay. That makes it even easier. Yeah. <laughs> and then from there we will go west and then north through the rush rush bog. That'll take us to Julian. And then we will have to stop. Twenty eight minutes, okay. So now I gotta find the She's on a stand. Firework vendor. Yeah. Where are you? Should probably be north of you a little bit. Sorry, on a, in a clock sense, you'd be on the. Fireworks vendor, founder. Yeah. There you go. A lovely day. There you go. <laughs> and then we cut through the bog to Needle Hole. Now it'll take us to Eric Loom, which would be right outside to the west, no, sorry, to the east of Julian, or whatever you pronounce it. Alright, so do I head south to Hobbiton? Yeah, the... Just run to me. Run to me. See you, where are you? You're way over there. Yeah. If you want to open your map while you run forward, you can really much so. You can see our path. It's not too hard. I gotta go across the bog? What? You said you're not scared. <laughs> But yes, it's it's pretty much the fastest way without spoiling our. Oh, uh, I went through the bog. I gotta go this way. All right. Yeah. So now we're going north. Yeah. Surprised you don't show up on the map. You only show up on the mini map. Uh, if you press M and go to filter map notes, you can check fellowship leader or fellow. Whichever one I am, in this case I'm a fellow, and that will show me on the map. Plus it allows you to, actually you could probably put it on the map and then. And then if you right click on the um, mini map, you can alter the um, list of filters that you have as well. It's pretty useful. track through a lot of bogs in this game until you're ready. <laughs> now, except for you, you probably just wouldn't be north of them. What's that supposed to mean? You're small, dude. 
Are you picking on my? Uh, you picking on me? No, I'm stating a fact. You're smaller than most people. I'm not a people. I'm a hobbit. So meh. Well, actually, I'm a Bjorn. They are a completely different race from man. Well. Enough shot for the bog road. My shot is gone. Alright, let's see. We just fall. Ooh. Run through some gnats. Eh, they won't hurt you. They might annoy you, though. Not, not annoying me, I need they're chasing you. Oh, no, they lost interest and stopped following. Yeah, they white dotted, basically. Stand in uh, the sense that you need to roll re roll on the Hobbiton thing, but I don't know. Whatever. Some people like it, some people don't. It's just fact of life. Fact of life. Which ones do you have left? Yourself? Self. 23 minutes. Fireworks for the festival, 600 meters. No idea. I'll, I'll probably try it all a little bit before I decide. Sorry about that. Stupid follow up dates. Uh, I know. But anyway, if you look up, that is the. Um, someone's probably yelling at us in chat about how bad it's saying it. <laughs> no, it actually, chat's really, really quiet. I'm surprised. It says there are nine viewers, but eh. Yeah. I was with Samias the other day, and he had like 20 or 30 at once. And I'm like, what?
follow-up question, especially for Chad. What's with the elf fascination with being up in the air, you know? Like, what in the world are they doing? Just if you pay attention, almost all elven buildings are, like, really built upward. If that makes sense. It's just... Wait, wait till you ever... If you ever get to Lothlorien, you'll fully understand what I mean. Only 19 minutes left. We're gonna make it. Oh yeah. Even if it took off eight minutes for your travel time, you're probably just milestones back once we're done. We don't have to. That's a couple of weeks from now. We don't have to do that. Mm -hmm. Now we have to go back and talk to Robert Greenverge. Yeah, we do milestones left to take it. Hello there. Summer festival token. Cool. Or summer days fireworks. No, it depends. Do you actually like anything from the of most inventory or do you not care? Huh? If you like anything from the cosmetic inventory, I would go ahead and take the coins. Or if you don't really plan on doing it, I wouldn't do it too much. It's personal preference. Ah, oh, so it goes into my wallet. I got the token. Mm -hmm. uh, you can check out what they've got while I figure out how to get to it. I got the. You didn't buy into the milestone? Well, mine was down at the time. To be honest, I stopped trying because I messed up something badly and I. I'm not too worried about it because there's nothing in the reward section that. So what do you think would be a good quest to do next? Um, personal preference at this point. Uh, do you want to 
to try to advance yourself, or do you want to just kind of keep around? If you want to keep around, just keep your vessel stuff. If you want to actually advance yourself, I would put that in and just start collecting. It's like I said, it's just an idea. Apprentice Star Forester Starter Pack. I don't know. We could try to do some leveling up stuff. Um, any preference? We have just like three starter locations, which is Eridboom, which we're in Team 4 with an L. We've got the Hobbiton, which is in Hobbit, and then we've got that engine what's it called? No, it's called Shire. My bad. Anyway, and then you've got Boogie Land. Um, I don't know that there's much left in the Shire. Alright, I mean, that's the easiest option would just be Boogie Land. Okay. Uh, let's see, level 11. I would say head to Combi on the map. That might be a net, or Staddle. Yeah, see, because of all the uh, Staddle, yeah. It's east of Bree. It's close to it. So, you want me to go past Comb into Staddle? Right. Yeah, I think that's about the 11 ish area. Okay. You might end up wanting to do both because there are, there are points and turbine points for doing quests. If you're not too worried about doing points yet, I would just worry about the, just all the quests. To be honest, there's benefits, even if you don't need t points like with me, um, if you do the quest, you get these traits, if you've noticed, it's like, uh, press J real quick, and go to, uh, virtue traits, they give you a nice result instead of having those things where you have to earn them. It's like I already have a compa compassion. Yeah. Oh, all your compassion is over. <laughs> uh. It's like I already have a soothing voice as well. Yeah, or class. So you don't have to. You don't have to like run to a trainer and then pop those in. You can pop them in as long as you're not in combat. Or it might be a bad companion, I don't really know. And then you just like turn them to shift if you want, I don't really care anymore. Oh, come on now. 600 meters to comb. Yeah, those horses are looking pretty good right now. <laughs> Uh, uh. Uh. <laughs> oh, stretch it out. Oh, it's dark in here. I think I'll turn on a light. 68 degrees is what my CPU is up to. Kind of getting on the warm side. Crank up my 
crank up my fan. I don't want to overheat and roast my CPU. I don't know what my CPU is at. I just know that it's pretty cold for the French. My CPU is at 69 now. My motherboard's at 43, and my GPU is at 57. I actually put my CPU temperature in the corner of my screen there. Just cranked up all my fans. I only really have any issues with it when I'm streaming. Of course. <laughs> Other than that, it usually stays around 50, which is perfectly fine. Stay a moment. I'd like to take a moment of your time. So I'm in comb now, picking up quests. Yeah, I would go ahead and do those. Because you're still at a point where they're probably bluish, and you can still get them for decent XP. Get more slots. Find the hanging tree. Purchase 10 additional slots for 40 mithril coins. That's all right. Pass on that one. I have no idea. Is that the problem? I have too many quests I'm sitting on? Uh, well, if you press L and look at the active quest, it's right under the quest log word. It says active quest, 40 of 40. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you haven't been doing your quest, apparently. <laughs> I pick them up as I go through. Yeah, but do you ever turn them in? Oh, well, most of them. Could be. I don't know. So... You may have some of your questions out of the way now, because we're... Alright, so, <laughs> so that means that you're ineligible. What's the green chat mark? Ready to complete. So it looks like I've already done it, I just haven't turned it in. Green check is all the way over to the right, yeah. Yeah, okay, then yeah, you're pretty much ready to complete it. If it's under the quest, that means your party member has already finished it. Yeah, I got some red X's for you, I've got some blue arrows for you, and then I've got some that are gray coins, says you don't have them yet. You got a couple of gray back arrows. It means I haven't taken a quest that's in prior to the chain. So like Ooh, what's this one? Epic quest. So it looks like I have one, two, five, six, seven, eight, nine that I could turn in. <laughs> two in Bree, one for crafting. One epic volume one prologue, three festivals. One in the Shire, two in the Shire. Should probably turn those in to get them out of the way, huh? It's up to you. you can do them on your own time or on stream. And like... Well, I can't pick up anything else until I do. Although I suppose I could abandon some other stuff. So let's add that one to the tracker, add that one to the tracker, add to that to the tracker, add that to the tracker, add that, that, okay, so I got five in there, crafting Michael Delving, talk to Emerald Boring. 
set as quest guide focus. No, the one that I'm heading to is in your direction. Yeah, but you can probably just ride to Michael's Delving if you want, unless you want to run. Can I ride to Michael Delving? Uh, I believe it's one of the main ones that they automatically give you. Like Solder at HE Tender. Like so, Michael, it requires Mithril Coins and I don't have any. Oh well. But my advice, if you see a stable master, even if you're on a timer, go ahead, grab him, because... So, I just, I just have to talk to him, right? Yeah, you just talk to him and then um, we'll... Okay. So, I probably, I, I just haven't talked to a lot of stable masters, so it's probably just that I haven't talked to him yet. Right. Speaking of which... I should put that on my map so I can stop and talk to him on my way through. Yeah. I wonder if I talk to the one in Bree. Yeah, that might actually be a good one to talk to. <laughs> Bree's like one of those middle areas. People can grab in the gate a lot, probably. Someone actually just been able to build these spots. <laughs> A plus if you get the reference. I get the reference. Yep. I don't think it's very funny, but I get the reference. I find it more funny that he actually did it than he actually. Question is, is does he get his own reference? Interesting. It's going to be a pain for me to get there, isn't there, because of the huge mountain chain. Uh, just head south. Head south. Yeah. Turn west at some point. I'm heading southwest. There's a stable master here. Probably the one I just talked to. What do you need? I mean, if I was smart, I would just get my captain and summons there, but where's the fun in that, you know? That's no fun. I know. I'm, I'm just looking for money. <laughs> Besides, it takes so long, I'm all the way in the jungle right now. It would take me 15 minutes to get there. I don't have to worry about doing that. Besides, I haven't seen this world of where it is in her head, but... It's like you're in Bree right now. I am. I was running into a wall, because I wasn't paying attention looking at the map. You auto-running? Maybe. <laughs> I do that a lot. Hey, Zender. Welcome. She's playing Lotro. What's up with that? I'm going to the stable master over here. Oh yeah, right, right. I know that. That is the south or east gate one. South. I think it's east and it is like southern east. Yeah, but it might call it east. I don't really know. Funny 
same thing is you can fast travel to the West Crew. <laughs> and that's funny. Looks like there's two stable masters here. One in the south and one in the north. I think I've been to the one in the north before. Travel to West Free in some locations, but you can't travel to the other gate. You have to go to West Free and then travel to the other gate by West Free. I don't know. Apparently, I can't even talk to the stable master. There we go. So he'll take me to Breland Homesteads and Combe. If you've already talked to the Michael Dell, you might be able to just go to there, but for like one uh, silver. Do you have the option? No. Breland Homesteads. Where's that? Uh, I believe that's. Oh, that's in the option. All right, and the other one that I have is Comb, which is back where I just came from. Let me go check the vendor up north, or the stable master up north, see where he goes. They might have different locations. Yeah, quite a bit's changed since last time I played too, is under. Well, what a better way to do it. I don't know. It's so weird. He's face, he's face first into the dirt. So, it's weird. Oh, oh. Whoops. Did I just do that? I'm just trying to see where you were. Yeah, I didn't know. Whatever. just took the stable from one stable master to the other one, didn't you? Yeah, because I knew Oh, wait a minute. Festival horse to the party tree. That in the right direction? Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's actually a lot closer than what Will was going to. You may as well just take the party tree. Just make sure you grab the stable. Oh, horse. Michael Delving, swift travel. There we go. Yeah. Heading to Michael Delving. Dead. You know what's funny? I completely forgot why we were coming here. <laughs> Turning something in, man. Oh yeah, oh, the crafting one, wasn't it? Michael Delvin Craft Fair. It's in 
this direction. It's the one like right here. Okay, so that one's done. So, can I sort these by distance from me? Um, I don't actually know. I think it automatically sorts the distance. Like, it'll show you the one that's closest to you. If you have it. Oh. Well, saying Breland is the closest one. Message of thanks. What if I track nearby quests? That brings up ones that aren't completed. Yeah. You've got the problem I did. You, you're on the right track of collecting everything, you just kind of forget to do everything. So you're like, <laughs> God. For me, I've got like 57 quests on my captain to go through. Let's see here. Message of thanks. That one is currently active 576 meters. Set as quest guide focus. That's way off in the distance. Not too far away. Not too, too far. I'm going to remove a dwarf blade made. Um, dwarf made blade. That one's way off in the distance. That one's way off in the distance to the keg races. I'm going to remove that one too. And then let's get the taste of Hobbiton. Needle hole watch. Let's see how far those those are. Not too far. Why did this one come back? Fishing hole. So a message of thanks is the closest one. And it's 576 meters to the northwest. Isn't too far at all. Where am I? Michael Delving. Oh, so apparently there's a... Where is the... This way. Will the stable master take me to Needle Hole? I'm not sure what that is, so I can't answer you. It's to the north, up in a crevice. Oh, did you grab the uh, thing that you did? No, he's not on. Not he's not on the list here. Hmm. Yeah, it means that it won't travel there from here. No, oh, no biggie. It's only 600 meters. We can run. Not like six thousand meters or anything. <laughs> some of them are, some of them are over six thousand meters. I can figure. Go this way. You gotta go through the Rushnuck Bog. Gonna be all kinds of crud in there, isn't there? All right, let me take it off auto run for a second so I don't run off any off any cliff. Let me see, why can't they hear you? Uh, that playback devices. Okay, that set as default. That set as default. Uh, 
Oh, so... Okay, I can fix that, I think. I feel like I've got this on board, too. It's weird. If you want, you can put me on follow and I can uh, sort it while you're working on it. Just right click my porch and hit follow. I try not to run me off any clips. Okay. okay. We work on that. Now where are you heading? I'm just going down the safe way so you don't break a leg trying to get down. I say there's a path that pretty much brings you right there except for going through the bog. Yeah. You can actually work on it or you can just kind of follow me. Do them both. I'm amazed that people can do that. It shocks me. So kudos to you, man. You've shocked me. <laughs> Don't you dare say it. <laughs> I'm talking about that Thunderstruck song, by the way. I just watched a show where the guy was talking about Thunderstruck. <sighs> The stream on my phone. <laughs> oh, good. It's better now, apparently. Hello, chat. Great, I gotta do my introduction and I'll lag further again. I still can't look at Twitch chat. It's the time of the day. Uh, did say needle born whatever, right? Yeah. Okay. Right here. Needle hole. There we go. There we go. All right. Wherever you need to go. So I don't know where you need to go. <laughs> There should be a stable mast around here, though. Yep. It's up on the hill, uh, for some reason. Hobbits in their weird houses. I don't understand it. How do you do?
Alright, so I don't need to do that anymore. I can put the phone away. Alright, so... I thought it said needle hole. Needle hole watch. Founder Chubb can be found on duty near the road leading into Needle Hole, due north of Michael Delving, northwest of Hobbiton. Chubb's helmet I can't use, or three cooked carrots. Oh, I don't know about you. Chubb's helmet? <laughs> It says that it's right here. Okay, that's why. 86 meters. There we go. That's got to be the one. Yeah, if you look on the map, you can, like, you can press M or whatever it's set to for you. Founder yeah. Chubb. Yeah. No, I can see why it's called Chub. I can't use the Chub's helmet, so. Yeah. I also use the cooked carrots. Alright, so what else is on the list? My grandson's lunch. One thousand nine hundred and thirteen meters to the east. That would be somewhere near Brock and Borings. Probably. Now, let's see what the uh, stable master can take you to, and then we can go from there. Because, you know. I haven't been over there before, so. Right. But that doesn't mean we can't, like, get to somewhere else, like Hobbiton or something. Let's see what. Let's just see what's available real quick. Alright. Uh, Hobbiton's available. Great. I don't know that I have the thing in Hobbiton either. Yeah, it doesn't hurt to check. It's not like. Not like it's gonna take an hour to get here. Yeah, I don't have Hobbiton either. Yeah. You want your old partner how you do? <laughs> no, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> Nothing against him. It, it happens. When I first started playing, I completely bugged on the getting stable masters and uh, believe me, you need to stay with masters eventually. You think, oh, I'm done, I won't need it. And then you're in Agmar, and you're just like, uh, I think I need it. Picking up a little. Yeah. Cool. Oh, I wish I knew how to get there. Get where? I don't know, Hobbinton? That'd be a good place to go. Yeah, it's to the southeast. If you open the map, you can see the name Hobbiton, I believe. It's not that hard to get to, really. That way I can bind there to pick up the horse guy, Stable Master. Yeah, we may as well take a swing there. He might even have fast travel up to Brock and Boring. No, if you haven't visited there, you won't be able to get fast travel. I'm 
following you. Wherever you go, I will go. I can tell. Ah, die. Oh gosh. No Titan. What's Titan saying? Yes, if it was a two liter bottle I was drinking. It's not. It's a three liter bottle. <laughs> I mean, you gotta go for the six liter. Wait, are we talking about beer or soda? Soda will get you killed. Ginger ale. Beer? No. Alright, so how do I target you? Uh, how do I, I target you? And I can that thing is me or target mine. Uh, you can't heal me right now. I can't. Uh, you can't heal me right now because your ballad stance. No, it says all heals are self heal only. Oh, Don't worry. It, 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 if I die, right. it's on my fault, not yours. But trust me, my self heal will. Or actually, it's not a self heal, I'm sorry. But yeah, that, that heal will keep me up no matter what. There's nothing here that can kill me, as far as I know. Alright. Why do you get me spinning around for? Nah, I'm any day now. Let's switch to resonance. Because uh, lag, you know how it is. I switch to resonance. There we go. Hmm. I am a healer after all. That is my job. You can be. You can be. Anyway, Hobbiton is to the east. Let's head east. Oh! That's a heal now? Good lord! What's up? Okay, I get it. Yep. Well, it's always a heal, it's just that it wasn't. No, I have other things that become it offensive. Have seen something I don't remember. Yeah. My, um, Coda of Fury becomes, um, dance. Melody of it? Battle. It becomes a heal instead of an offensive, depending on which dance I'm in. Cool. That's actually pretty cool. Of course, town doesn't lag, but the wilderness does. It's, that's great. Anyway, here's the stable master. And then we head... We probably just go north and... Get the overhill. Uh. A lovely day, isn't it? Oh, Michael Delving, Needle Hole, West Bree, Stock. I don't have Stock. Brock and Borings. I can't get there yet. Okay. It is on his list, though. Cool. Yeah, we may as well just head north. Seen these task boards yet? Hmm. Yeah. yeah, I should probably introduce you to these task boards because they're semi decent XP and they give you a lot of reputation with different factions if you plan on going that route. All right, so what's this? Deed bestowed. Dynamic performance, whatever that yeah, is. Just... I got a lot of those deeds bestowed that I should probably look at sometime. Um, I'm trying to think if your deed bestowed. Yeah, what was it called again? I got a whole you bunch of press... them. Yeah, you can press Shift L and that opens up your deed stuff. Shift L. Instantly. Yeah. Or whatever your all right. are. 
Yeah, I haven't changed anything from default. Right, so, yeah, for class, looks like I have Enduring Morale, Harmonious Melody, Herald's Hammer, Improved Herald's Strike, Life Singer, Light in the Dark, Powerful Voice, Smooth Voice, Unrelenting, and Dynamic Performance. Alright, so class dudes, at the very minimum, have a maximum amount you can raise them each day. Things like quest ones, and I believe, do not have this limit, but I know that class deeds do, so just keep that in mind. Places of the Dwarves, two out of five. Huh. Yeah. There's a bunch of neat stuff you can do that will give you nice stuff. That's a huge thing to do there. Alright, so we're heading north right now, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I was going to show you the task board real quick. See this task bulletin board? Yeah. If you click on it, it If you, like, in this case, I'm pretty sure it's, like, gray items that you basically just spend or trash them. Yeah, they can be turned in to here, and will be, and you'll get reputation and XP. You have so, a limited amount per day you can do, for obvious reasons. It's kind of like, like, five. It's kind of like dailies. Well. All right, let's head north. Rock and Except boring. you can build them with different factions. Yeah, I just want to sit. Sit Like, I'm lagging so bad I can't even see my weapon. That sucks. Rawr. It's all the giant bear ass. <laughs> bear rear, I should say. While you do that, I'm going to open up my character panel real quick. Do some more skill stuff. Oh. And yes, I don't mind doing this. <laughs> some people would actually be like, dude, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> Residence is a healing focus. And I get healing and motivation. Order of Resonance. Other strike. So I can hit something and it will heal everybody. Okay, interesting. Melody of Battle. That one there, that can go. That there. Excuse me, it's falling something. Ugh. Still gotta finish, figure out how to do the whole fishing thing. What? Oh, finishing. Uh, got a level nine menstrual. I don't really know much about him. I'm just waiting for the ambush. I swear there's gonna be an ambush. <laughs> I can walk backwards and I'm still faster. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay. Okay, not picking on the hobbits. 
Oh, man. Or it might just be because you're following Adam the Witch. Maybe. Alright, we're at the stable, Master. Alright. No, I am, and you'll be catching up in a second. Let me turn you Let's down a there. little bit. Yeah, because now I'm loud, right? Apparently you're too loud now. Let's crank you back to 150. Yeah. Good idea. So I can go back to Hobbiton anytime. And what is the quest? My grandson's lunch. Bring the lunch basket to Wilcone Tunnelly. I gotta find Wilcone Tunnelly, which is this way apparently. 350 more meters. So it's actually over in Skyru. Oh, now you're being all quiet. Hmm? No, it's just pondering. Pondering? Yeah. I'm quiet, quiet, here, it's quiet there. Time. Quiet flying through the air. Ah, excuse me. How rude. Yeah. Alright, so I'm looking for... Wilcom Right there, tunnely. One right in front of me. Yeah. Turn this one in. It's good I'm picking up all these stable masters so I can use that ability. Oh I had two of them. Yeah. Finish now. New quest, okay. What else do I have that's completed? That one's already in the tracker. That one I took off the tracker because it was too far away. That one's on the tracker. Fishing holes on the tracker. That one was too far away. Taste of Hobbington. Let's add that one to the tracker. To the taste of Hobbington, 28,000 meters to the southeast. That would be. A Forsaken Inn near Weathertop, maybe? Way off in the distance. What does it say? Talk to daughter two foot. Take a horse from Michael Delving stable to get to the taste of Hobbington. So I got to go back to Michael Delving apparently. Okay. There. Yep. There we go. I had to mute myself for a second because my grandma was talking. If I go back to Brock and Borings, I can get back to Michael Delvin from there, I think. Probably. I mean, I'm not too sure, but then again, I've never been to this place. I don't know. 28,000 meters is a long ways away. Almost 29,000 now.
So I can take the horse to Michael Dwelving. Um, no, but I can go to Hovington. So let's go to Hovington. And then from there I can get to Michael Delving. Yep. It's not a fast travel, by the way. It's going to be a... You get to see the scenery while running. Yeah, I like it. And I don't have to worry about fences and whatnot. <laughs> True. The, if you ever end up getting to Mori, I think I've told you this story, but the, let me get comfortable. This might be a bit. Aw, oh, man, are we already there? No, we're going to go to hell. Um, in Mori, there are enemies. Pretty much every enemy has a stance, like defender stance or attacking stance or a healing stance. Some enemies, yeah, like this one enemy, it's like a berserker. When they get low on health, they'll buff themselves so that when you hit them, they heal that damage instead of take it. And you have to interrupt it, otherwise you have to wait there while they tip down. It gets annoying after a while, but it's pretty cool. Okay, we're here. Alright, so now we can go Delving. Yeah, we can go to Michael Delving from here. Oh, good day. And from there, I can take a horse to Taste of Hoppington. You mean the quest is in Hoppington, or...? The name of the quest is Taste of Hoppington. Okay, where do you need to go for that? Apparently... 30,000 meters to the south and east, wherever that is. Got about an hour left of the show. Yeah, this is so much fun. <laughs> I'm not too worried about it though. It's nice to play with someone rather than have to. I'm gonna finish that sentence with this thing, because that's creepy. Alright, so now I can't have you follow me because I don't know where to go. To be honest. Alright, so. Festival Horse of the Party Tree. Shire, Hovington. By the way, you can dismount halfway through a trip. Just hit the dismount button when it pops up. Yep, I saw it. So, is it in Hovington, or...? I don't know, I've never done this quest. You'll have to read it and figure that out. Talk to daughter to... 
You can access by talking by taking the horse at Michael Delving Stable Master. The horse is only available during the event. Is this one of the uh, summer event festival stuff? I think so. Hmm. Doctor Daughter Two Foot. She probably a party tree then. So is that the party tree horse festival party horse? Possible. Yeah, let's try it. I try to do both. Talk and type because of the delay. All right, so yeah, that's still way down over there. Party tree. Yeah. I know, but it's a habit. What, the talk while you type thing? Yeah. Yeah, I do it too, don't worry about it. <laughs> Anyone who says they don't is crazy. I don't know. I'm thinking I'm going to crash the kite. I don't know what that's all about, but I'm not touching it. Cat. Hey, what's this little ball thingy? Box gloves twine. Oh, found item. So I guess these are a quest that I'm actually on where I need to find certain items. Possibly. They're not blinding up for me, so I assume yeah, it's a summer festival for me. Covered crash kites, one of six. Okay, so that's something different. I don't know, but I'm going to abandon the taste of Hobbington one, just because. How do I abandon a quest? Uh, go to the quest log and hit, click it, and then hit cancel. Ah. Yeah. That one's gone. To the keg races. Thorin, you should head to the Thorin's Hall Stable Master. All right. Wait, I might, might have seen something that might relate to this. Oh, I am typing. Uh, yeah, um, there should be horses around here that would lead there. Where are they? What's the deal with the rally horn? Why is that a bad thing? Is that kind of like the bell of opening in DDO? Oh, come on, is it gonna, is the client gonna crash on me again? No, lag, okay. The other day I was uh, streaming, yeah. and the client kept crashing on me, repeatedly. Uh, Alright, you need to go to keg race? Yeah, keg races. Yeah, Talk I'm at to... a horse that will take you... I'm at a horse that will take you to the keg race. Oh yeah? Yeah, if you go to the public Lotro server, um, the current week sales and freebie will be available in the pinned items. Or if you don't have access to the pinned items because you're on a mobile or whatever, you can actually do... Um, uh, bang sales or bang freebie. And a bang is an exclamation. 
and it will tell you what the current freebie and sale is. Okay, so I am at the keg races, is, is it? Interesting. Bink bink, huh? Stable master, keg race, party tree. Oh, let me talk to the stable master while I'm here. Well met. No blonde? I don't know what that is, but okay. So where's this keg race thing? Talk to Jorfrey. Interior quest location. Let's check that out. That's not where I need to be. Where are you at? Still way off in the distance, huh? Yeah. There's that. I totally wasn't doing a chore real quick because my grandmother reminded me and I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Jorophy, where's Jorophy at? Keg race of Thorin's Hall. Oh, 15, 15 south, 103.6 west. Shrink me down a little bit, I suppose. I could probably drag this up over here. I don't know why that says it's loading something, but it's not. Okay, so 15, 103 points. 103.6, that means I need to head. Wrong way. Fifteen south, one oh three point six. Tally. Head in the wrong way. Head back this way.
At your service and your family. All right, so that's that one's finished. Oh. By Durin's beard, won't you give me? Um, I think it's supposed to be 35. 30 down, 5 up, I think. Getting 36 down right now. Let that finish and I'll see what my up is. Doing a speed test.net real quick. That's fine. Yeah, I'm getting 36 down and 5 up. I did a lot of research and found that 2100 or so is optimal for mobile. I'll consider ripping it. All right, let's see here. A tiny little area with no real map to it. Horse to the eating contest. Well, I guess I should do the quest while I'm here. Basically find a couple, couple items. Very laggy in here. Greetings, traveler. Yeah. That's why I didn't go in there, because last time I went in there, it was so laggy. You just... Mm -mm. I, I, I'm trying to keep my settings pretty static 
And since DDO stream isn't a partner channel, I guess, I wanted to kind of have it optimal for everybody I stream on. I just got to find the mug now. Is there a button for target? Target closest objects? Mm, like maybe tab? I've never actually had to target objects in this game. Yay, one summer festival token. Greetings, traveler. Will you stay a moment? I'm not going to do that. All right, so... Horse to the eating contest. I guess that's the next place to go. Mm. So I'm in the Shire now. Apparently that's where the eating contest is. Twenty five thousand meters that wait a minute. That's where Daughter Two Foot is. I found him. But I already been in that quest. Eh. Oh well. Where am I anyway? Um. Where am I on the map? I don't see myself. I see Gondor, Rohan, Moria. Yeah, we got a. We're in like a special area of the Shire, apparently. <laughs> Now we gotta find a way out. Great. There should be horses nearby. Here they are. Ah. Uh. Yeah, I can't read all the chat. Oh, what's going on? You know what? I'm going to bring up Hex chat and read it. It does, but it's a pain to set up, which is why I said I would look into how to set it up for the different client. Horse to the keg race, horse to party tree. Okay. I guess we're going to party tree. Yep. Alright, so. Where's Bywater? Let's see here. Bywater. Oh, not too far from here. Head straight south through Hobbinton and then to the west. That's where the next turn in is going to be. Hmm. Said south and then west? Yeah, head down to Hobbington and then west. You sure you don't mean east? I don't know. East, west. Same thing. No, because <laughs> no, they're not. <laughs> it's not like they're exactly opposite each other. Come on now. <laughs> Whatever you say, buddy. 
I'm an old man, okay? Don't argue with the old man. Alright. Well, technically you're not wrong, but you're not right. Like, if you're, <laughs> if you're facing southwest... No, I'm east. left! <laughs> <laughs> Give me the bread basket. I want the basket of bread. Alright, so there should be a... I've already talked to the, um... Stable guy here? Yes. Sure. I have? Hey, there's a milestone yeah, here, too. Hobbiton. Remember, we went to Hobbiton to uh, Michael, Michael Bloving? I thought that was Brock and Borings. Whatever. Yeah, we got them both. <laughs> it doesn't matter. If it doesn't have the blue symbol above its head, then you're fine. Cookies. Cookies here, cookies there, cookies flying through the air. Elderly hobbit with a fire on the on his head. You know that's funny. <laughs> Lore wise, we don't actually die in this game. Technically you're not dying. You're just Becoming scared and running from the fight. That's basically what you do because we don't have health. We have morale And when you, you normally don't die when your morale goes to zero do you? You know, I don't know. I Mean you're probably a scaredy cat at that point, but I mean same difference you're dead, but you're not technically, technically dead Where the heck is the dude? Oh right there, okay so he should be right over here. I am looking for... Netty Grub. Netty Grub, right there. The fishing hole. How do you do? The basics of fishing. I should probably read that, right? If you want to do it. Woodsman Guide, Auction House, the basics of fishing. Character journal, clicking the hobby button at the bottom of the character panel. As well as a fishing action button, which you'll want to assign a quick slot. Okay, so character panel, hobby, fishing, I want to put it in a quick slot. Okay, now what? Equip your fishing rod. Where's my fishing rod? Probably in your inventory. I might have put it in the bank, <laughs> in the vault. Oh, right there. <laughs> Basic fishing rod, okay. So I can head over to here. Put my fishing pole. Put that there. And then fish. Okay, then what? I don't really know. I never fished before. You've never gone fishing? Is this something Not you do? You just game. you just stand here and don't do nothing for a while? I don't want to get agitated. <laughs> I'm not kidding. Fishing makes me very angry. Well, real life fishing anyway. 
So once you see the thing bobbing, you click the button again. Okay, so let's try this again. Throw the throw the line out there, wait for it to bob. Reel it in. I caught a fish. Wow. You just increase your proficiency <laughs> in a hobby. As your skill increases, you will open up the possibility of obtaining new or better outcomes. I picked up a Mathem min level 20. So I can't even use it for a while. Okay, that's fine. I'm putting my fishing pole away. Alright, so what's next on the list here? Talk to Lobia Sackville Baggins. 429 meters to the northwest. That would be the hill. Hmm. Is this an epic? Um, it says prologue flower dumplings. Hmm. Might be an epic. Epic volume one prologue. Yep. Eh, looks like Feels I'm already like... done with it, whatever it is. Couldn't have been that yeah. epic. <laughs> Not do that while moving. Crashed kite. Oh, goody. I need three more of those. So now I only need two. Now, oh, picked up something else. Let's see here. Obia Sackville Baggins. A body be left alone? Don't... Hey, completed. So now I'm down to 34 out of 40 active quests. Message of thanks. A dwarf made blade. Those are the last two I have completed. Let's see which one's closer. Message of thanks is 1100 meters. The other one is 3600 the other way. So let's do a message of thanks first. Right, to I'm the to call you for a second because I got to go do something real quick. Okay. So I'll be right back.
Good night, Queenie. I'm just gonna send it to auto run. <sighs> Look out for that tree. Feel for a little delving. Okay. Maybe that's why I haven't completed this one, because I couldn't figure out how to get there. My, where is it exactly? Little Delving, I think. It was like up in the middle of the mountain over there somewhere, and I couldn't find where the path is to get up there. Maybe, I don't know, we'll see. Might be right over here. Yeah, it's right up there. See that little gate arch to the right? I see it. Yeah, that's probably it. Uh, excuse you. No, man, if it was me, you'd all be sniffing something bad. I just had ice cream. Burps are good, burps are great, burps are better than a date. Mailbox. Mithril Trader. Mithril Trader, what does that give you? What do you do? Now for Mithril Coins. For 10 Mithril Coins, you could actually get the Riding Trade. And I don't know how much Mithril Coins are, so I don't know if that's better or worse. find out visceral coins you can buy five of them for 50 turbine points so 100 turbine points for 10 that's worse riding trade itself was only like 90 right unless you bought a large chunk of mithril coins you could buy a hundred of them for 850, and then it would be an average, it would be eight and a half coins. Hmm. 85 instead of 90, and then 250 is 2,000, so I don't know. But anyway, is there a way to earn missile coins? I would say kinda, because you can farm turbine points and then buy them. That still requires you to buy TP. That is right. quest guide focus. So we need to head 4,750 meters to the due east, pretty much, for a dwarf made blade. What does that bring us? I wish, this, I, I wish this map had distances for it. So you can see how far things are. 
Hmm. So. Yeah, it should have, you know, a little map scale down here that tells you how far a certain amount of distance is. Rare reward from Hobbit present, Mithril Coins. Okay, so you can stumble upon some for free. Yeah, cool. Good to know. So, I think it's near Bree, huh? Possibly, if it's one. Did, did you pick it up in Breland? I have no idea. What does it say in the quest log? Most of the smiths of Bree dwell near the west gate or are working at Thornley's farm along the greenway. Lofar, yeah, I know what you're now. Lofar has told you that he thinks the latest blade was stolen by one of the mansmiths. He thinks that a warrior such as yourself might intimidate the thief into confessing and returning the stolen blade. Yeah, it's near the west gate of Bree. So, I can use my return to festival grounds Breeland to get me much closer than I am now. Yeah, I might actually do the same. Oh! Slash stuck or slash unstuck, huh? So, I need to now head 415 meters to the south west. Following me? Mm -mm. Serious business, huh? Yeah, I'm just running straight. I didn't realize there was a wall there. Alright, so if I press numlock, I can go take a nap. <laughs> Southern Bree Fields. Oh, it means I have to go through to go through a pond to get there taking the straight straight route ow i broke my leg i didn't <laughs> that again for you uh did did there you go <laughs> i'm auto running man i know that's so funny <laughs> Hey, there's a big red young bear there. He's gonna chase me. Actually, no, he's gonna threaten you. Yeah. He's just gonna threaten you. He wasn't very threatening. <laughs> I guarantee you, if he actually was to fight us, we'd probably lose, or we'd have to retreat. Because the higher level they are against you, the more likely they are to just completely negate your damage. Because of a deflect skill. Talk to the Smiths of Bree. Getting the blade back. Find Nate. Yeah, only 185 meters this way. Finding Nate. Finding Nate. Finding Nate. Finding Nate. Right now, I've got that thing stuck in my head. Thanks a lot. Hey, Nate. Nate's on a date with Kate. They're sharing a no. plate. No, Don't I'm hate. TV. I'm angry at TV, not Nate. I see Nate. Nate doesn't Holy look so good. Me. No, it, uh, hmm. Wow. Searching uh, the body. Hmm. Wow. Well. Alright, so back to this way. <laughs> How much more are they going to send us right back over here? Yeah, maybe. Young field bear. Alright, I feel like hacking something, so... Kill it. Hack. Don't come back. Oh, you got a serious wound, man. Be careful. Who cares? I'm a bear. I'm literally a bear. <laughs> Who cares? 
bring forth the hilt to some low bear guy. Low far iron band. 300 meters this way. Auto run, have a drink. Auto run, eat a raisin. Use the bathroom or you'll stink. <laughs> Yeah. That's why I can't rap, because I start cutting up and laughing almost instantly. Why do you laugh? Because it's good for you. Laughing is good? Why, but it's good? Apparently. Laughing is great. Just don't laugh in my state. Ow. What is the meaning of this? By Durin's beard. Forging a new bear blade. Bring me items for repair to Kent and Thistlewood. Back to whence we came. <laughs> yeah, just like I told you. <laughs> this is essentially what I told you. We're basically just running out of errands. Yeah, I've noticed that most of these low-level chains are running back and forth, running stupid errands. Yeah. That's why, this game, them, that's why this game has always been so hard for me to get into in the past. I'm sure that yeah. it breaks this pattern, and there's a lot of cool, fun things to do at higher levels. But this whole running back and forth at low levels... Bite? Kind of lame. Yeah. Although Bree is really, it, it, it does that less, because you actually get to kill things more often than not, and you're not just gathering them, you're actually killing things to get them. It's built together at little times, but for the most part. Collect yeah, iron scraps, collect flawless boar hide, search for trinkets. Yeah, now we get to kill things, yay. Why are you bothering? Wait, did it say bear or boar? Oh, I collected an iron scrap there. It says boar. Forging a new blade, 163 meters this way. Oh, you got a boar hide, huh? Nah, medium hide. No, no, you're right. You're right. I'm killing my own kin right now, and I feel no shame. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> yeah, coming. Alright, so now we just have to search for trinkets. Cool. And guess where they probably are? Are they right around here? I don't see them. Hmm. It's probably within the pit, then. <laughs> Alright, somewhere down here. It's probably see anything. inside. Well, if you look on the map... I see, a I see a debris pile. Yeah, it's around here then. Um, you got some friends. See that. And they deflected. Nine out of ten of my attacks. Yeah, running around might not be the best idea. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> this is where I was saying that Bjorn is kind of OP at the stage. Let's see if I can hit a thousand. No, but I hit a hundred. Oh. Well. Oh. Hmm. Well. Oh. 
Jesus. See what I mean. Backpack here in a debris pile. Hmm. Uh, I actually need the drawer I don't need. Scholar I don't need. You can take it. I don't have enough room to do that. Uh -huh. Yeah, I think you need this thing. Found trinkets, one of three. Okay. But yeah, did you notice what I meant? It doesn't say you've been killed, it says you've been defeated. It's a big difference between the two. Not seeing any more debris piles. Hmm. Here we go, here's one. Things for us. Another backpack here, Yay. and I see something over there too. You hit level 12. You know what I just noticed? Or do you want to know? What 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 do you know? I should have named myself Tap. That way we could have been Tap and Shoe. Um. <laughs> Be Tap Shoes. I don't know. I'm just. I'm starting to get tired. My brain's picking at straws. And I got this guy. I am diseased. All right, so yeah, that's yeah. all of that. Now we can head back to where we're going. Yeah. Or maybe not, because this guy's probably going to harry you. Or whatever turn they use in this game. No, he's not even going to catch up. No, he's catching up. No, I don't know. I can't tell from here. Apparently I'm diseased. Oh, yeah. What do I have? Minutes. What do I have to remove disease? Excuse me. Uh, I don't know. Possibly don't have anything to remove disease. Hmm. What can I do for you? All right, so I need to throw something out of my backpack. Prince's jeweler scroll case. Broken hatchets, ten chunks of barrow iron ore. You can throw away this basics of fishing, right? Uh, if you don't want to continue fishing, you might. I don't. My disease is almost gone. Yep. Oh, and there it goes. All right. So, talk to Lofar Iron Band this way. He is here. 
I am not. Something, something in a pot. There's a rhyme in there, just kind of... Oh, there was rhymes. I just wasn't going there. Ah. Rhymes are here, rhymes are there, rhymes are flying through the air. It is an insult. A blade for a life, 649 meters to the northwest. Can we just kill these NPCs and take the sword for ourselves, please? <laughs> oh, what fun would that be? Come on now. Actually, that'd be a lot of fun because it would be very... Uh, it's a word I'm looking for. It, it basically means uncommon. It's a special word for uncommon. I wish I could modify the settings on my, my UF bars. Your buff bars? My buff bars. What do you it's mean? A, it's a plug-in. Oh. It shows you how much time is left on cooldown for things as you go through. Apparently it doesn't go any higher than two minutes. I wonder if you just passed it. Passed what? Your quest objective. No, it's um, 365 more meters. Okay. Uh. My judgment of, of space is not that good. <laughs> I have all kinds of potions and whatnot in my inventory. Uh, you might not there. want to keep running. You might not want to keep running. There's a lot of enemies in this thing. Are there? Quite a few. You're gonna end up having to fight some because they interrupt you when they when you try to get the box. Yeah. Also, you're gonna die if you don't. It's on the other side of the fence. Yeah. Oh, that's right. I remember this one now. It was a pain to get to. I'm heading back up. Okay. I figure out how to get there. Something tells me we'll finish this quest, or maybe question and then call it.
bring in some friends. Five hundred and sixty four damage. Yeah. That's about normal. Hey Blake. It's a really weird name. How many people actually want to be known as Blake? You know? I don't know. Man. I need some better heals. The crap. Yeah. Is she gone? No, she's not. Now where'd she go? I don't know. Is your quest done? Got the little coin thingy this way. I don't see her little icon anymore, so... Maybe. By the way, don't stop running. Just, just huh? take my advice. <laughs> uh. Ah. Yeah, my heal requires some wrath. Or rage, rather, so it's kind of hard to heal without it. Without being in combat, but for an early level heal, it's pretty good. And you'll probably be closer to your destination anyway, so that's pretty good. Yeah, only a couple hundred meters. Sharky's men. What do you need? Might I take a moment? Ooh. Do I want some leggings? Gives me plus five fate. Or a band that gives me plus four fate. I think I'll take the leggings. Oh. 
I have to complete it first. I have to go meet the spy, which is 204 meters to the east. Yeah, it should be right near the uh, opening for the uh, north gate. See a coin. Brigand Informer. You startled me. Protect the spy from the brigands. It's probably not a good thing. like a, sh a block action in here like shift and ddo i don't can take less so. damage yeah. that's lame i could be wrong though i haven't played in a while spy hands a bundle of notes take the notes back to the other guy Next one's a quest level 15. Yeah. For me, I think I'm gonna call it. I gotta get up early. Yep. So, thank you for having me. Absolutely. Chainmail, huh? Heavy armor. All. Alright, later all. Later. I need to find a vault to put stuff in, or a tavern to get rid of stuff. Vendor. Let's see here. Map notes. Vault keeper. There's one not too far, and there's vendors. Okay. Down here. just about for me to call it a stream too. It's almost midnight. President, follow me. I'm gonna log out. Okay, over here. Over here, over there. Send off my junk. Like the notes. Vault right there. All right. Open vault. Okay. Okay. 
that to level 20. That to level 15. That for whatever reason, that's medium. I'm going to just sell it, not proficient. The rest of the stuff I can pretty much just sell. bank option oh cool Okay, so shop service sell hides logs. All that. Uh, eh, sell it all. Lock that. All. Some more room. Oh. Okay. Oh. What can I do for you? Bloodstone. Fresh light candle. Apprentice roll case. Um, re recipe. What do I have any use for here?
I'd have to be trained for that. I'm gonna hang on to it and get training. No. Okay. That's good. Alrighty. So I'm gonna call it a stream and we'll see what we do next week. No idea yet. Good night, everyone. I do gotta get a splash screen and a big camera. Hopefully Jerry gets that done soon. Have a good night.